<laughs> oh man, what are the odds? So, what's up guys? It's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Heart Gold Soul Silver walkthrough. So, after I stopped the episode, the last episode, we right there got a call from Baoba. If you guys don't remember, Baoba is the owner of the Safari Zone. This guy right here is calling us and he's like, Oh, hi, Draven. This is Warden Boba. Sorry to have kept you waiting. I finally come up with the next test. I'll give you more details at the Safari Zone. See you there. Yeah. So the next test is uh, about to happen. We will be taking care of that right after, you know, Team Rocket. Because the next test is going to be a good one. And, uh, yeah, I, I, I really, really want to get some Pokemon there that, you know, could be beneficial towards our team. So, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to heal my Pokemon because I didn't get the chance to do that. And, uh, do, 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 yeah, we're, yeah, I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, so we're back, guys. And uh, we, may, we might as well just stocked up on a few items and all that stuff. So, the next step in this whole Team Rocket situation is we have to go back down to the underground path because, well, they stashed the, whatchamacallit, the, the director of the radio tower right down here. And, uh, well, let's see, before we do anything, I think Thrasher, like Thrasher, it had enough with that, uh, the experience share. So now, let's go right ahead and where, 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 where's the experience share? Holy crud. Okay, hold on. Yeah, we didn't really take it. Okay. So, we're going to switch out the experience share for this episode and give it to another one of our Pokemon. Are you kidding me? Yeah, we just got glitched. I'll be right back, guys. Okay, so we're back. Again, glitches. You gotta love them, guys. Uh, it usually happens like that. So, we have to go down right here to the warehouse in order to get the director. Now, what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna be switching it up to Nessie right here because, well, we got some business to take care of. Now, as you guys can see, there is a Kimono girl waiting for us right here. She's like, Team Rocket members in black suits have been running around. I was wondering what was going on. So, you took Team Rocket, took on Team Rocket. You are impressive. You may be able to face the legendary Pokey. Hmm. <laughs> Never mind. I must go now. Okay. They're ready. So we're going to be going right here. And, well, let's go right ahead and put in this basement key and all that stuff. And, well, here we are in the underground basement. Of course, we're going to be going up against somebody that we already know and hate. Right here. You can hear the theme song. Hold it. What I told you before was to deceive you. I thought it would let you tell, oh, let me tell you, and it would lead me to Lance. Well, he never showed up. No matter. I was planning to beat you after Lance, but since you are here, I will repay you my debts. Okay, so <laughs> he will repay his debts. Here it is, guys. Another battle against our good old buddy Silver. This guy right here wants to be. He, he wants. He wants revenge. Okay, time to uh, do a maximum effort right here. So here we go, Ice Shard. Trying to slow him down, trying to make him look pretty dumb. Yeah. Look at you. Look at you. Okay, so you are you are getting uh, your butt kicked in. Yes, we're gonna get confused right here. So yeah, we're gonna speed this through since we are confused. And go ahead, Ice Shard for the win. And there you go, Nessie. We have. We have given Nessie the experience share, so it's going to be gaining some levels here pretty soon. Now he's going to be not with a Magnemite, so let's go with Cinder. Right here, we're going to kick some butt and take some names right here with Cinder. And look at this, Cinder in the last episode has evolved into Typhlosion. So that's a big positive right there. So let's go straight for a Lava Plume. And this one... Oh yeah, this one will make sure that Magnemite is defeated. Look at that, okay. And, well, he's going to be coming out with a Feraligator. So he's finally evolved his Pokemon right here. So let's go straight for our good old buddy, Fluffbolt. Okay, Fluffbolt. Let's go right ahead. Let's get it. And let's go straight for a Charge Beam. And, wow, this Pokemon has Thrash. So this is going to be this is gonna be interesting because Thrash is a very, very powerful, powerful Pokemon for anybody who has high uh, physical attack. And, well, look at this. Charge Beam does its trick, and it increases our special attack, so let's go ahead and do it one more time, and, well, here comes a Thrash attack yet again, and, well, look at that, oh, yes, 
And there it is. Charge Beam for the win. And well, let's see, who's next? Who's next? I don't know. So, let's see. We're going to get a Sneasel right here. So let's go straight back to our good old buddy, Cinder. Ready to kick some butt, take some names. And there we go, Cinder. How's it going? It's been good. And, well, here comes Sneasel. Again, another Pokemon that I've... Yeah, that I would would have loved to use, especially here in the Heart Gold Soul Silver. But it's Final Evolution, Weavile. You have to actually equip it and then trade it, I believe. Or actually, no, no, no. I, I completely lie. You equip it, you level it up, and it and then it evolves. And uh, yeah, I don't think you can't get a Sneasel until I want to say the Ice Path. From that point on, it's just a little too late to actually grab it. So. We're going to stick with the team we got, and this guy right here, he's like, hey, why so serious? Oh, well, extra sensory, and of course, Confuse Ray is going to confuse us. And there we go. He is now finding out. Wow. So he just defeated himself. I really don't mind. So there it is, guys. We have defeated our good old buddy Silver. Let's see what happens. Why did I lose? Well, you lost because you suck, man. Anywho, I don't understand. Is what, is, is what that Lance guy said uh, true? That I don't treat Pokemon properly? Love. Trust. Are they really what I lack? Are they keeping me from winning? I... I just don't understand. But it's not going to end here. Not now. Not because of this. I don't give up my dream to becoming the world's best Pokemon trainer. Okay. I would flip you off, but you're probably learning. And of course, our mama is calling us yet again. Because, well, she's... Spending our money like crazy. And yes, we got, yeah, we have to go to the Pokemon, yeah, department store and all that stuff. Anywho, let's go right ahead and start beating everybody right here. All right, we're going to speed this through because, well, there are a bunch of Team Rocket members and we need, we got time. Like, we need, well, there's time. Time is money. We need to beat everybody. And, of course, there's some switches right here. He's coming out with a muck. And here goes another Surf Attack, and there's level 32, and we're finally learning Ice Beam, a much more powerful Ice type move. Let's go ahead and switch it out. Let's go straight to Togepi, and go with this guy right here. Let's go right ahead and continue on with the same thing, and do a Fly Attack. Look at this, Fly Attack again, and we missed. So let's go Extra Sensory. Just like that, we have defeated another Team Rocket member. And, well, let's go ahead and grab these items right here. Look at this. We found ourselves a full heal. And that right there is pretty good. And, of course... <laughs> wow, how many items has my mom bought for us? Quite a few. I mean, a lot. Okay, so the majority of these items happen to be berries. And we happen to get one one good... Uh, well, we have... Yeah, we got ourselves, whatchamacallit, a moonstone and all that stuff. So... Here we go. This guy's telling us to fork over our goods, and, well, these guys are burglars, so they don't necessarily work for Team Rocket, and there's an Ice Beam coming out with an, uh, well, coming out with another Pokemon right here. Let's go straight for Togepi, and Extra Sentry works, and here comes Magmar. So, let's go with Thrash right here. I want to give Thrash a little bit of love. Dig Attack, and there you go. We got burned. Holy crud. Yeah, what a surprise. So, let's go right ahead and heal up our Pokemon. We do have a heal burn, or we do have a full heal just in case for this situation. So, there we go. And... Well, it looks like to me... Okay, so there, yeah, we have to go through this area right here. Now, we will eventually figure out the whole mystery of this whole place. Because there are switches. And here we have a smoke ball. And... Well, let's go right ahead and take on these two trainers. We got a burglar. And, well, let's go right ahead and just battle this guy. All right. Everybody wants us to fork over our stuff, but, yeah. <laughs> We're not doing that. Let's go with Togepi. Togepi, extra sensory. There you go. And we win. All right, bring it on. Who's the next one? All righty. So, the secret right here is something. Let's go right ahead and go with the Surf Attack. And he's coming out with a Muck. So, let's go straight for the Rasher. That way we prevent anything with a uh, kind of poisoning and stuff, and just like that we win. Okay, alrighty. So, 
here's the deal, guys. You got three switches, and you have to actually you actually have to uh, get the uh, the right combination to get to this area right here, which will lead you to the, towards the very end. And I think this is how you do it. You press press blue, you press green, and then you press red, and from there it opens up this portion right here. So follow that same direction, and bam, you're gonna be right here. Bring it on. Are you lost? No, you can't be. You don't even have a scared look. I'll give you something to be scared about. Whatever you say. Alrighty, so here we are. Take Team Rocket Brunt. And we're going to go with the Nice Beam for the win. And there it is. Level 33. And we're going to be going with Gloom. So we're going to go with Cinder. And bam. Lava Gloom does its trick. Okay, so that was easy. Let's go ahead and press this purple button right here. Which will enable us to... We'll get down here real quickly, so... It's not like the next time we're going to be going down there. So, here we are in the second room of the of the uh, underground path. Now, I did train up Nessie to get to level 33. So, let's go right ahead and give that experience share to somebody else that might need it. And, well, let's go ahead and give this. Hmm. Who should we give it to? Who should we give it to? Let's see... You know what? Let's give it to Hercules because it does have a shell bell. Let's give this shell bell to Togepri. And let's give this mystic water to our good old buddy, Nessie, right here. Okay. And, well, let's go right ahead and continue on our adventure right here. As you guys can see there, uh, we're in the underground warehouse. And we're going to be finding quite a few items, like an Ultra Ball. That's always good. And... Let's see. Yeah, we got another Team Rocket member right here. Let's bring it on. You're not going any further. I don't show any mercy to my enemies. Especially not brats. Oh, wow. Especially not brats. Okay, so bring it on. We're taking on another Team Rocket Brunt. And we're going to be speeding through this one, too. And, well, look at that. Coming out with a gold bat. Let's go with Fluffle. And go with a charge beam. And there you go. Level 33. How's it going? Yes, we are making progress. Okay, let's go right ahead and move on right here. And hold on just a second, guys. I'm getting a phone call and text messages. <laughs> That's kind of an uh, annoying thing when you get two text messages and a phone call at the same time. You have to really pay attention to it. That's why, you know, I always put my stuff on silence just to not disturb me on the radio right here or not the radio but the microphone anywho uh we got ourselves a max ether and from what it looks like to me is that we're very very close by right here and we got to take on this guy and well let's see what happens <laughs> i remember you you got me good at our hideout yes i did and this is uh well i can already hear it, it kind of sounds like goofy right is it the goofy laugh because if it is then that's funny anywho surf attack for the win and coming out with a wheezing, let's go straight for a Thrasher right here. And go with a Thrash. And Smokescreen's gonna hit us, and just like that, we win. Yuck, 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 yuck. Kinda sounds like Goofy and all that crud. Anywho, let's go straight for the Director. And we got one more dude right here. Let's see what happens. How did you get this far? I guess it can't be helped. I'll dispose of you. Okay. Let's uh, go right ahead and take on another... Team Rocket Grunt, as you guys can see, Team Rocket Grunt coming out, coughing, and well, we're going to be going with the Rain Dance, and going with the Surf, that's right, we don't really need, we don't really need a Rain Dance, but still, we got something, and bam, okay, so, here it is, we got to the director, he's going to be like, who, what, you came to rescue me, thank you, the radio tower, what's happening there, taken over by Team Rocket, here, take this card key, and there you go. We got ourselves a card key. Nice. Use that to open these shutters at uh, the third floor. I'm begging you to help. There's no telling what they'll do if they control the transmitter. They may be even to uh, maybe even able to control Pokemon using a special signal. You're going. You're the only one that I can call on. Please save to the radio tower and all of the Pokemon nationwide. So my question is, why would you have a? Eh, never mind. So here is TM uh, TM82 uh, sleep talk. My question is. Why would you have a radio transmitter that will control Pokemon? Is it Team Rocket or the radio tower? I'm confused. And, well, look at that. We found ourselves an amulet coin. 
that right there will be needed when we need to get some extra cash and all that stuff, so yeah. Anywho, let's get the F out of here and move on with our lives because in the next episode, yeah, this is when it's all going to end right here. And, well, let's go straight up right here and look at that. Okay. So, you guys do not want to miss the next episode because it's going to be a very, very interesting one. And uh, I just realized something. Let's go ahead and see what our mom has gotten us. So, let's see. It's quite a few packages. Here's a Yaki Berry. Uh, Chipotle Berry. Uh, let's see. A, Bobber, a, ba a Barbie Berry. And, well, that was just three. Okay, never mind. She got us some three... Some three stuff right here, so... Anywho! Here we are, in the Pokemon Center. How's it going? Anywho, you guys don't want to miss the next episode, because we are going to finish up this whole Team Rocket thing. Thank you guys again for being patient. Thank you guys again for being supportive and all that. I will be back for another episode of our Pokemon Heart Gold Soul Silver walkthrough as we finish up the Team Rocket situation. See you guys.